everybody and welcome back to my channel subscription boxes and more with Michelle and I don't know what happened to my single swag box I haven't gotten it but I finally got my paradise delivered these folks are owned by the same people Fair, uh, paradise delivered and single swag are owned by the same folks and hey paradise delivered single swag people where's my single swag I sent you an email what happened to it? All right, so I really like Paradise Delivered. I don't know if you do or if you've gotten it, if you thought about getting it, but I really like this box so far. Let's see what's inside. Here's our inside. And again, they have that beautiful tissue paper that says Paradise Delivered. Let me see if you can see it. I love this tissue paper because it's got the logo on it. And, um, oh, there goes my box lid. Anyways, I just think it's a nice touch. I really, I really enjoy that about this box. And it's really nice tissue paper to reuse. To reuse. Uh, when your next box, post a photo of your box on Instagram or Facebook and tag Paradise Delivered. I keep forgetting to do that. I take these videos. <laughs> Apparently that doesn't count. And it is your spoiler on the other side. Let's set this here so we can... There's our inside of our box, I think. Hello, gorgeous. You must be talking to that lady. All right. Thing. Talking to me. Let's see what this is. Is it an advertisement? Is it a something? What is it? $40 gift for you. WW W shop ian.com or land.com i don't know add some swag to your closet hmm. we will check that out <coughs> this has been here for at least a week guys i've not been feeling the greatest so i'm a little behind all right gen three little kind of envelope -y thing. It sounds like there may be a jewelry. There's usually something jewelry. Really? Somebody's mugging their grass while I'm trying to record. Shame on them. Uh, there's usually some kind of a jewelry item in their boxes, and that's exactly what... Ooh. I like this one. Can you see it well enough? You should be able to. I have all kinds of lights on. Um, let me get a little closer. It's... There's, like... This whole thing right now with these different like bar type necklaces that some of them are just silver or gold. Some of them are different colored like stones. And obviously this is kind of a cor corally pinkish peach color. And it's a necklace. So there's the chain and it looks like it. We have to open that. It's weird looking. Hang on. Packaging opens up neat. Trying to get it out. Shut off on me, camera. It's acting weird, like it's gonna shut off. It's like the screen keeps going dark, and I'm not sure why it's doing that, other than that maybe my battery might be going dead, but I just changed it, so that should not be a thing. Alright. Okay, so there's this little like gold bar piece right here next to the clasp. Mm, let's not be getting my face in there. Let's try to. Can you see it? Probably not. But anyways, uh, and then this extender chain, and it's got a little thing on the end of it. You probably can't see, but I can't tell. I did. Mm. Anyway, that's neat. And then the necklace. I like that a lot. It's really pretty. I mean, these are like it's a very popular style right now. These bar necklace things. I I received one in black from Fredmer Jewels, and it's um. 
glue didn't hold and so it the like part that's supposed to be like the stone or whatever just in the bottom of the bag I got that one and I got I think one that's white from them also and now I've got this one anyway I got it in a little tiger but so <clears throat> that's by Gen 3 it's pretty that's like Gen 3 that's even the first thing that should have come out of the box Stella pink pendant gold bar necklace $48 this striking trending necklace is sure to become a new staple in your collection wear it alone or layer it with your other favorite pieces it's got a 17 inch chain with a 3 inch extender $48 really pretty next what's this babe lash let's read about it it is a 65 dollar essential eyelash serum get lush healthier looking lashes while promoting the appearance of longer thicker lashes with this transformative award-winning formula and a favorite of the Paradise Delivered team. Um, I got not this one, but I got a different lash like serum stuff that was supposed to help with your lashes. Um, if you didn't have, you know, like thick lashes or long lashes or you have brittle lashes, whatever. It's in a few boxes back, not from Paradise Delivered. I don't even remember who. And I have used it a few times, but I think I haven't used it regularly enough to see any kind of benefit from it. So I'm going to try to use this one more often. Suggested use. Use in the evening by applying the serum directly to the lash line on clean, dry skin. Use a single brush stroke for each eye. Avoid touching eyes until the serum has dried. When satisfied with results, continue using babe lash serum two to three times per week to maintain lashes use only as intended for external use only keep out of the reach of children and if you're allergic or you have sensitivity quit using it of course why would you need to tell people that i guess some people need to be told well just like some people should know that when they're allergic to cats they shouldn't have a house full of cats well I went 50 years without having cats. I didn't know that I missed having cats because I didn't know because I didn't have cats. And now allergies, no allergies, I don't care. Love my kitty cats. I'll suffer. I take three different allergy meds. All right. Panera. 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 Mm. Secret of the Aeolian Islands. Grapeseed infused hand cream. We always need a hand cream because I have such dry hands. Okay, this is grapeseed hand cream, $22. This lush moisturizing hand cream boasting a anti-aging, antibacterial, and moisture uh, retaining properties will leave your skin feeling silky, smooth, and bursting with vitality. For a deep hydrating experience, massage lotion onto the hands and fingers, paying close attention to the cuticle area. My oldest son has told me I have old lady hands because they're just so wrinkly and cracked and age spotty and I think I can smell everything else I've been touching. <laughs> it's a nice heavyweight uh, lotion heavyweight as in you know not runny not heavy lotion um, matter of fact it seems to be a light lotion in that um, it doesn't feel it doesn't feel heavy on the skin it doesn't feel overly greasy a little bit because it's not dry yet um, it does not feel sticky has a nice smell very light scent I like that. It does feel very hydrating. I like that a lot. What's up next? Well, I don't know. 
But you look at that, and then I will look at that. Isn't that pretty packaging? Refreshing strawberry, cooling mint, soothing lavender, energizing citrus. Chloe Emerald Beauty Bar. I'm assuming this is like soap. Let's find out. Chloe Emerald Four Piece Beauty Bar Soap Set, $20. Love your skin with this gentle ultra moisturizing bar soap set featuring our individually wrapped bar soaps, each in a distinctive fragrance. Good quality soap is one of life's simple but important luxuries. Hallelujah. Especially when you have a lot of uh, allergies and skin sensitivities and so a good soap, important. One that I'm not allergic to. <laughs> Doesn't give me hives. <laughs> all right, I just want to get one out. So they all have their own packaging. So this one is the cooling mint. Well, I'll get them all out, why not? Refreshing strawberry. So it corresponds with the color on the box and the scent. Soothing lavender and energizing citrus. Nice little small bar of soap. Let's see if I can get one open. Open the citrus because that's one in hand. Mm. I was trying to open it without doing a whole lot of damage to the packaging. So I want to put it back in until I'm ready to use it because right now I've got a um, bar of soap um, I don't like the smell of this one too much it's got like the like see the gem there makes me think of you don't want to know what I'm smelling guys is urinal cakes and it may be because it was next to the, you know, right in the same thing with the mint. That is what I'm smelling. This one is not all that pleasant a smell. Now, once that... Um, the mint one, again, I'm getting the hint of urinal cakes with mint. Lavender smells like lavender. I think it's because those two, I, I think they're not mixing well. I don't think it's, I think once you rinse off the smell of the other one that it'll probably smell all right. They don't really smell like strawberry, but I'm not sure what that smells like. All right, I'm gonna put them back in the box. And um, I think that they don't smell the greatest mixed together, the scents. But, you know, it comes as a boxed set, and, you know, you don't want to, I mean, they are individually wrapped. I'm sure they didn't mean for them to mix badly. And maybe to your nose, it wouldn't smell like a urinal cake, but to me it does. All right. Then what, why do I know what a urinal cake smells like? Well, I've been in the men's bathroom, whether I wanted to be or not. But that's a really nice little gift box. And I'm sure that the soaps themselves will be really nice. And I'm sure that that smell, like I said, once you get them wet and get, so that you're only getting one scent instead of multiple scents at once, probably, probably be great. Stroop waffles. This seems to be a common um, item in I, in these boxes, the stroop waffles. This one's a caramel waffle cookie product of Holland and there is two in here so I can taste one on camera however I want to melt it on the top of my coffee cup I tried to but I did not let it get warm enough so I didn't get like melty enough and I want to actually experience this as it's meant to be experienced which is to heat it over your cup and have it get warm and gooey Mm. But they're good even without being warm and good. I had always wanted to try these, and the price tag is why I had not until I got it in the subscription box. I'm going to have that here in a little bit. 
Next. Oh, the strip walk. We were going to look and see how much that's worth. Fig, uh, can't talk. Finger licking Dutch. Strip waffles, caramel waffle cookies. $4. These two delectables are a perfect treat any time of the day. Enjoy right out of the package or warm by placing a cookie on top of a hot coffee or tea mug, which will soften the caramel inside and release aromas of cinnamon and sugar made with love in the Netherlands. Okay. Next, South Main 3 Eye Gel Packs reduces puffiness, reduces dark circles, moisturizes eye area. Apparently I'm gel masks are um, really popular because I keep getting them and I just got them in another box and I'm going to be trying those tonight. Under eye gel, thoroughly cleanse eye area, apply this product under the eye, leave on for 30 minutes to reduce puffiness and dark circles. Use promptly after opening for best results. Use for three consecutive days. Well, that's important to know. South Main Revitalizing Eye Gel Set is $10. Ensure you look and feel rested and refreshed all day with a set of three cooling and soothe, uh, softening under eye gels. Place one gel under each eye. We already said that. Uh, following the contour of your cheekbone, let sit for 15 to 20 minutes and remove. And I thought this said 30 minutes. This says 30 minutes. This says 15 to 20. I'll probably use it for 30 to get the most out of it as long as it's not irritating my skin. Um, so there are three packages. Three of them. See? And you can see like the shape of um, in the package. I don't know if you can. Where you can. So, you know, think of like the football stuff you know, under your eye, like that black charcoal stuff. All right, I am going to try those for sure because I do have, because I don't sleep a lot, I do have puffy under eye area and all that. I'm going to try those. They must be very popular. What is this? It is a little zipper bag. Jules K. Jules K. Copper Pouch is $38. This stylish, versatile bag can be carried as a clutch on a night out or slipped into your purse or tote for additional storage while you're shopping or at work. Either way, you're sure to make a statement with this shiny standout accessory. out the packaging so you can actually see it without it reflecting off of the plastic so it's got kind of a um orange peel type texture or you know faux leather kind of texture and it is it says copper but i guess it could be copper it could be in my lighting in here it looks more like a um a little bit of a gold color to me it is very sticky along the edge, so they've obviously glued it together and sewn it, and it's very, very sticky all the way around. Hopefully that won't stay like that. Nice zipper across here, and it says Jules K on the inside on a little piece here. It's kind of stiff. Um, nice little, you know, to carry maybe some you know, your makeup for the evening to refresh your face, whatever. I may put that in a giveaway eventually, but I don't know because it's sticky. I don't know if I want to. But anyways, it's $38. And I think if you're going to pay $38 for something, it should not be sticky. Just my opinion. Um, maybe a little uh, powder will take that stickiness away. I don't know, it's a nice $38 bag, sticky around the edge, which is bothering me. I will try to like use a powder to see if that will help to get rid of that stickiness. 
I don't like that it's stiff and doesn't open all that wide. It's just not my thing. It would probably be good to carry whatever makeup you're wearing for the day if you're going somewhere and you just need a small little clutch to carry your makeup or if you wanted to throw it in your purse for that purpose, um, you know, in a larger purse, whatever. I can see somebody else enjoying this. It's really not so much my style. Um, and being that it's a $38 retail uh, item, I will probably give that away as long as I can get the stickiness to go away. The next thing, and it's already out of the packaging, I really apologize, is this Cambridge Proper Multi Wear, I think it's called a ban Bandeau. Um, there's different ways to style it. You can probably see it better on the packaging now that the thing's out of it anyways. Like 10 different ways to wear it. I took it out because I was going to show it to you. First of all, it's this nice like tie-dye blue kind of deal. All that it is is a piece of material that is, I was going to say sewn, but it seems to be like woven all in one piece. And it's just a long, see. So there are different ways to wear it. Ten different ways. You can wear it as like a gator thing. You put it over your head and then you pull it, you know, it goes around and you pull it up over your face as a mask. Obviously, I'm keeping this one because I've now put my face on it. Or you can put it... Okay, I wasn't going to do that, but it's a little hard to show it the different ways. Okay, right? So you can use it for a mask. You can use it for a headband. You can use it for a ponytail scrunchie. Ugh. You can use it for kind of a more of a beanie style kind of hat thing. How? I don't know. Kind of like this. I don't know. <laughs> um, you probably can tie it in a knot. Tie it in a knot. Tie it in a knot. I don't know. And, you know, different tuck it under something. Um, you can wear it kind of like a, um, scuba mask. Mm, really? So they have it kind of showing like over your head and then your face sticking out and then it goes down your neck, like kind of, you know, various ways of covering up your face and wearing it. Oh, uh, sorry. The hair now probably looks great. Um, you can use it, like I said, a scrunchie for a ponytail, or you can use it as a scrunchie and make a bow, a uh, bun. You can make kind of a um, pirate's, you know, thing, scarf out of it. You can wear it just as a scarf, just around your neck. You can wear it as a workout headband, you know, like this. Or you can put it around your wrist. If you really wanted to have it around your wrist for why I don't know um but because I've had it all over me now it's mine I have another one like I said um, that you may not have heard that I got either in this box or single swag something I think it's the exact same color and everything that has never been opened that I will maybe give away to someone maybe somebody else would really like one of these I don't know it's really not my thing but now that I've got it it's mine now I'll give it to a grandkid probably they can play with it um that is $18 all right guys um am I loving this box I don't know yet <laughs> usually I do love it more um this time I'm a little on the fence it says it's a retail tail value of $225. Um, and then this being a bonus, the $40 um, gift. So I mean, if they're giving you $40, you know there's nothing there that's $40. Bucks. It's going to be more expensive. So you got your necklace. You got your lash stuff. You got your hand lotion, which I do like. You got this bag that I'm... It's, it's fine. I'm just not that big a fan. You got your eye gel things. You got your soaps that smell strangely like urinal cakes. And you got this thing here, this scarf thing that I'm not sure what I'll do with. 
And you got your troop waffle, which I know what I'm going to do with that. I'm going to eat it. So, um, my favorite thing in this box. Well, without being able to test to see how the, which we didn't even open. And that's nice packaging. Without testing this out, in, which you'd have to use over time, um, I can't say whether or not this is my favorite. It says Lash Like a Boss. So I can't say. Um, I don't know the eye gel things. I haven't tried them yet, right? So just based on what I have tried, I really do love the necklace a lot. I love the hand lotion. Um... I love the shoe waffle. So, yeah, I mean, there's nothing I really don't like. I'm, the bag is not really my taste, but um, I know somebody will love it. And this thing, I didn't, didn't like it well enough to have it once, let alone twice. But other people may love these. Uh, and maybe if I had more hair, maybe I would love it, this. So maybe I'm just not giving it enough of a chance. I like the little, you know, that has this little reusable bag. You can put it back in. Um, I want to know where my single swag box is, and I do want to get this again because I really do like Paradise Delivered a lot. So, what do you think? Let me know in the comments below. Um, do you like Paradise Delivered? Do you like in this particular box? Um, what is your, what would be your favorite item in it? Um, do you like the multi-use bandana Thing. Um, and if so, how do you wear it? Um, I think as my hair grows, I may actually like it. I may actually like it to wear as a headband kind of thing because it is, it is comfortable. Um, I doubt I'll be wearing it as a scrunchie because I doubt my hair will get that long or thick. And there's probably some things I can do with that. Um, I'm going to check into this and see what they have. Um, I'm going to eat that street waffle. <laughs> Anyways, let me know what you're thinking. Please, please give me a thumbs up. That really will help my channel. Please let me know. Um, I did say that. Let me know in the comments. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And please, please, please share my video with others because you never know. They want to, they might want to watch uh, my videos and listen to me babble too. <laughs> um, and with that, thanks for watching and listening to me babble. And I will see you again in another video in just a moment, but that might be the last one because I'm starting to get a little bit of a scratchy throat from too much talking. That's what I get for babbling, right? <laughs> Thank you, guys. Bye-bye. <laughs>